welcome friends my name is krishna kardate and you all a welcome in my youtube channel invest for tomorrow friends today we are going to talk a such a good topic and the topic is useful to those who are going to pass out from a last year of their graduation and the topic name is win the campus placement race so in this video i am going to talk about how to win the campus placement and that is the recruitment directly companies from colleges so the basic thing while you are facing the interview before that you need to face interview the the things which you have to consider and study before going to face the interview so we'll see what kind of things we have to consider number first find out which are companies coming to your campus second thing what is their selection process and how many peoples or how many students are going to apply and how many peoples or how many students they have to hire in their company so again you have to find if you are eligible in that or not that is the fourth thing so next you need to understand the placement rules of your your campus if you are get job earlier then you have to find you are again eligible to reapply for next job if you are dream to apply in a particular company but you are selected in another company so that is again problem to you or your dream is not coming to true so this is again very important so before that discuss your classmate discuss your friends seniors or teachers about the companies and your dreams so match all those things then you have to select a proper one so so i will tell you the things or steps to doing this number first first step is building your cv and online profile then build a professional looking a linked in profile with your sober picture to display you are a, you are a young one so you are using social sites so the second thing is that you need to clean your social sites where you have put all immature stuff with your help with, with the help of your teachers and your uh, good friends so then set aside a la- at least 2 weeks to prepare your resume or cv so these are the very basic thing basic thing so one of the major part and that is called a resume so while preparing resume you need to consider some point and which are very very important when you are going to select for interview that is a next step but before selecting or shortlisting for interview you need to you need to proceed with the first thing and that is called resume so resume should be very very short as well as very crisp so what are the things which are has which has to consider while preparing your resume so preparing resume you should or you must have to keep your resume short and crisp so first thing you have to consider and that is that is long first draft you need to write all your qualities all your qualification all your experiences on the draft and then you need to shortlist or you need to compress that draft and then compression you will get such good content that is needed to for employment or the job so second thing is make most of spaces while you are writing your resume you need to give a particular spaces that is in common sense if you are using ms word so you need to min- minimum the font size is 11 inch and your space should be 1.15 or 1.50 and your font uh, is just like official font that is arial you can use it in your resume third thing is rule of thirds a recruiter is not going to over you all your inter- all your resume 
he or she just overlook your resume that is the one third part first one third part and you need to write all those things which are required for that particular job description so your one third minimum 6 second he just overview or see just overview your resume and then decide is he is a short listed for the next step that is interview so you must write or you must write down one third part first one third part with your all regulated eligible criteria and your eligibility number 4 cream on top cream on top means you are understood that uh, always the things you have or the skills which you have or you are in the master so write it on top because top is very important and after that the cream things that is you are qualities you must show on the first four line or first fifth or sixth line up to sixth line make then then you have to consider or left is right because we are trained or our mind mind is trained to read from left to right or this is what so the first thing you are reading so commonly people are considering next thing just guesses or considering the the things are like this so last but very important that is story in numbers most of the students are writing their bullets or dashes but my suggestion is that you have to write it with numbers so interviewer or recruiter just see the qualities your your achievements in numbers then he will think about that friends this is very very basic things and the toughest part of that that is uh, like a group discussion aptitude test technical interviews uh, then subject matter interviews coding and hr interviews these are the things which are happening commonly happening in the interview process but before shortlisting interview you need to write or you need to consider all those things which i have explained before it so what should not come to your resume that is what not to put on your resume so typos and spellings some of the times preparing interviews typing mistakes like spelling mistakes so this is very because your resume is very short and in that you are making mistakes that is very negative impression on the recruiter then number thing laying about skills it is very very good that you have lot of skills but you have to write such a skills which are required for that particular interview uh, very very important not write all your skills in a one resume but write those skills which are very important for that particular job description number 3 objective statements yes you have lot of achievements but you need not to write it in objectives or objective statements i have did that i have done that so you need to write it your after uh, write it your achievements and your experiences that is your experience after your experience title you need to write it your uh, objective what you have achieved then number 4 that is templated cover letters so many companies are there and you are just uh, following one template and that template have to uh, uh, send all the companies that is very wrong the company and the, his job or his profession so you need to make your template like that company's requirement number 5 that is reword the draft while you are preparing draft so you need to work it again and again and again because your draft have changes sometime you have accomplish anything more important or the company is required that so you have to prepare it or you have to mention it on the top friends i have explain you how to win the campus placement race so the very important thing first very important thing is that that is resume and you have to consider all those point which i have mention or before or talked before you that is long first draft make the most spaces rule of third then 
cream on top number 5 left is right and step or story in numbers these are very important and they ignore the things which are very very negative impacted in your short listing or criteria that is your resume you have to put before interview so friends if you get all the things i have explained so i definitely uh, discuss with you in next video uh, that is how to face interview and how to face uh, with best uh, posture gesture and the things while considering interview from uh, for next video so if you like this video so uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and press bell icon to get such a good videos from next videos thank you so much